Stupid slanted. However, you're weak to rocks, so thank you for existing. Let's do this. Let's go. Thank you for existing. You served a purpose. It was to help me evolve. Thank you for serving your purpose. Hey guys, Pony here in another episode of Pokemon Ultra Sun Let's Play. In the last episode, we beat Kiawe's trial, came up here to Route 8, helped an Aether Foundation employee with their Vulpix, and met up with Dos and, uh, what's her name? The, the female one. Um, and also met Colrus, which is interesting. So let's see what we can do this episode. I'm gonna fire up the Pokefinder because there's a photo spot here and I'm wondering what exactly I'm seeing a crap brawler. Okay. There's a cave back there. All of them are like the same picture, except the first one. Yes. 684. Okay. Didn't think so. Thought that'd be pretty bad. Um, now for the important thing. I did say that my next team member would come after two trials. It is not a Trumbeak. Although that is kind of cool. The Trumbeak is just here. Crap, you're super damaged. Oh god. Can I run? Can can I Can I go heal? Um I'm a little bit of a pickle here. Can one of you nice Aether Foundation people heal me? I don't want to go all the way back to this Pokemon Center. <laughs> it's a long way. Here's a Magmar again. I gotta go here. I have to keep going. Here. And finally! Yay, Pokemon Center. I can also buy a big Malasada from the Malasada shop. I'll do that. Rockruff is healed, thank you. Ooh, and I should tell this kid, because I fought the trial captain and I did a battle royale. Um, excuse me, are you the person of courage? I think so. Is that right? So nice for you. Perhaps a courageous person like you would like to listen to my worries and help me. If for a minute, I already listen. Yeah, yeah. Dude. Dude. And so you told the boy about taking part in the battle royale. That's the thing that I was going to tell him? Wow, that's amazing. You actually took part in a battle royale? Even so, if a Pokemon battling against one other person takes plenty of courage. But going up against three trainers at once, you can do that? Yes, it's a new thing in Generation 7. You know, hearing about that gave me a bit of courage. I'd say I'm 20% courage now. If you don't mind, please come and tell me more courageous deeds when you can. Does the trial... Uh, nope. Trial doesn't help. Maybe Aether Foundation will help? And Team Skull? Maybe those are things you're looking for? I fought the Team Skulls later in my life? Nope. I need the biggin'. Give me a biggin'. Biggin'. Okay, bye. I should explore. I should. What are you doing over here? Oh, hello. We're members of the Malasada fan club, self-appointed Malasada promoters. I'm Mala. This is Pukamuku. Pukaku. Pew. We're working hard, day and night, to promote our how delicious Malasadas are. But he's just like, ugh. Why does she look so disgusted? Let's start, Pukamuku. Or Pukaku. Pew. It's a different pew. 
we'll be filling our bellies with the marvelous, magnificent, positively man-sized Big Mouth Salad. Man-sized, ew. Let's dig it in once. Let's dig in at once. Munch, munch. Pew, pew, pew. Pew, pew, pew. Mm, amazing. I keep eating. Munch, munch. And eating. Munch, munch. Pew, pew, pew. And it just never runs out. Munch, 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 munch. Pew, pew, pew. Did you eat the pew? Okay. The heck. Tune in again tomorrow for more munchies. There are mounds on all sides is waiting. Just like an infomercial. Living infomercial. What do you think about the commercial song we sang? We sang. Oh, it actually is a song. Pukuhuku is more of an ideal mascot than Slurpuff, which can't be caught in the Oil region. You see, the flavor bursts right out of it. Phew. I appreciate your support, but they are a bit distracting. Yeah. Well, focus, focus. Let's get back to selling Malasadas. We'll sing until we become the store's mascots. Or until you, you give us Moo Moo Milk. My Pukumuku will spit its guts out. Uh, can, can I see that, please? I want to give you Moo Moo Milk. Or do I not have Moo Moo Milk? That could also be a possibility. Six minutes well spent. <laughs> Yay. I'm good at this. Hi, Magmar. Bye, Magmar. I should also go explore that coast, but eh. Eh. I don't care. <laughs> I could also explore it from this side, too, right? Because there's that entrance right there. Nope, no, I can't. <laughs> okay. I got you your big malasada. You want it, lady? Cure. Oh, I know. You have a big malasada. I think Vulpix trusts you enough that you could give it a try with the malasada. Get it, try malasada. You gave the big malasada to Vulpix. Crew, Vulpix began eating the big malasada little by little. We did it! It's eating the malasada. This is thanks to you. Do you think you can come back and visit Vulpix tomorrow or whenever you have time? Yes. Okay, bye. I have to catch a Gumi. I have to catch a Sableye and a Gumi. I'm gonna hate SOS. Okay. Can I find the Pokemon that I want? Yay, Carhorn. Can I find it? No! How rare is this thing? Where are you? New friend. Where are you, new friend? Where are you at, though? Nope. That's a young goose. I just want to catch it. That's all I want. That's all I want. It's my life stream. It's really not, but you know. It's a Slandit. It's female, I'll catch it. Nope. I'm just saying that just because it would be nice to get Salazzle in the Pokedex. I'm not gonna use Salazzle again. That would be treading too much familiar ground. Come on. Where, where is this thing? Uh, oh, you can get Combuskin and Island Scan here? Oh, of course, of course. Clearly the only thing I haven't run into yet, so the thing I'm trying to ca oh my god, that was grit. Stop it! Fine, you wanna die? The thing I'm trying to catch is Stuffle. That's the next member I want on my team. But of course, it's a 5% chance to find a Stuffle here. It was like one of the first things I found in Ultra Moon. Ah, uh, 
Oh, woe is me. Crap, I don't want I don't want Bridget to level up. I don't. So I want Bridget to get use of her stats. You need good stats. Let's try out Firefang. And so if it happens to knock Bridget out, no one cares. I don't, at least I want Bridget to level up to level 25 when it's actually the right time. Of course you use the weakest ghost type move you have. Well, it's probably the only ghost type move he has. But you're a grass type. Why not go for a grass move? I love how it can't evolve into um, into the other forms of lichen rock, so it's just gonna evolve into dusk lichen rock. Oh, this might kill. Yep. Okay. There we go. Effective, effective. Let's go with Fire Fang. Let's go for it. Fire Fang! Kacha! Now I could just set my clock to four hours in the future. Um, I'm gonna do that. Here's what I'm gonna do. I will... I will dodge trainers. Of course you see me. Of course you see me. And I just want to get to that Pokemon Center. That's, that's my goal. It's my only goal here. Just get to that Pokemon Center. That's, that's my main goal. I want you! Give me you! I need you. That's all I need, bro. Bye. This is probably going to kill you. I like how I got the Quick Claw for Bide, but um, he still went first because Bide is priority. Oh, does it show Bide in the bottom screen counter? Because I saw the plus. Interesting. I didn't know that. Hmm. Or you know. Nope. Swiftly avoid you. Hi, how? Hey, Brennan, you heard the Festival Plaza thing. I guess it's like a festival or something where lots of people get together and have fun. You, I can tell whenever, when you, I can tell you've never visited Festival Plaza. No worries, I'll teach you how to visit. I just heard about it for the first time too. Let's see, I think she said, yeah, you're supposed to open up your X menu and tap on the Festival Plaza. I don't even get the chance to do that. Welcome. Welcome to Festival Plaza, I'm Sophocles. Hi, Sophocles. I don't care. This is a secret place where you can come and play using communication features. Okay, Sophocles. We're holding a festival where chairs can interact right now. We need someone to welcome those who have come here to play. You kind of seem like someone who would play a lot using communication features. There's something you could do for me. Help me liven up this festival. Yes. Alright, thanks. Pretty sure if you said no, he would just keep saying that until you said yes. Okay, so you gotta help me out right away. Someone's come to play, right? Go give a chat with them. Go have a chat with them. Hi, friend. Came here because I heard the festival wasn't going on many trains here. You're the host, aren't you? Do... Do you know what to do when you see visitors? I'll have a chat. That's exactly what I expect from you. Please take this token as my thanks. 2FC, please speak to visitors. I hope you boost the moon in the festival. Okay. You crushed it. 
If you respond to the request of someone who has come to play, they'll give you festival coins as a token of appreciation. Festival coins are sometimes called FC, so try to remember that. You can use FC at the facilities in the festival puzzle. All oh, right, I better tell you about the facilities in this festival puzzle. At a food stall, they can give your Pokemon delicious food to rapidly raise it. At a goodie shop, you can get items for good value. I'm just trying to close this thing in my pocket. At a fortune teller tent, you can learn your fortune for the day. <clears throat> At a dye shop, they can change the color of your fashion items. There's still a bunch of other facilities you can look forward to those. I imagine the fortune teller is just like looking at your next objective mark and saying like, you're gonna do that. Once again, people have come to play. Respond to their request and you get festival coins. Uh, hello. You know, find people who listen to their stories, listen to their whispers. That's not creepy. Impressive, please take this as a token of my thanks. Or FC, listen to their whispers. Tell me, tell me. Hello. Do you know how to invite people for your, to your festival plaza? Communicate. Great. Please take this item as a token of my thanks. 6FC. Festival plaza run at the rank 2. Why is it 6FC that does it? Or is it? It's probably 5. But they gave me 2 each. South Quiz is happy. Go to the front of the castle. Play a lot using communication features and invite a lot of people. People near you come via local wireless communication. People far away can come via the internet. Okay. You crushed it! If you get a lot of festival coins, that means you liven things up and entertain those who come to play, so your festival plaza rank will come up. Alright, let me give you a roar of sights for raising the rank. Let's build a new facility on Sopin Spot. It's run by a Pokemon breeder. It's a food star, a rare kitchen star. It's a single star kitchen. I wouldn't want to eat there. Just saying. Whenever your festival plaza rank goes up, I'll give you a cool reward. Respond to requests and get a lot of festival coins. <sighs> oh yeah! When you're in festival plaza, you can connect to via local wireless communication to the air. I'll set everything up, so give it a try. I don't care. I don't care. I actually don't care. There's a menu on the lower screen. Can I use it to escape? I Sophocles. I actually don't care. Welcome to Festival Plaza. Nice to meet you. I've been waiting for you. This is the place where we swear you're Let me briefly explain. I'm the information desk. I'm in Festival Plaza. Speak to me. <coughs> PC for communication. It'll connect you to the services and internet connection. Balancing game sick. This is the reception next for the global missions. Don't care. Participate in them. No. This is where you have page trainers. You can use the service when you talk to a particular visitor. This is where you do remodelings. You can switch the order of the facilities. We'll do our best to boost the mood of this place. We'll look forward to working with you. Now we still have preparations to do. Please come again. Okay, bye. What do you think, Brennan? Pretty fun, right? It's great to get to meet so many different folks. So how did that work? Did I just go into, like, a simulation? Or did I leave and come back? How did that work? <clears throat> how did that work in-game? In now we're gonna go have some fun with my team. Okay. You do you. Let me heal. Please. I just need to heal. That's all I need. Da da da. Okay. And now. I'll be right back. Okay. So. Um. Let's see if I can't find Stuffle again. And while I'm looking, I'll battle with Rockruff just to evolve it. Stupid Salandit. However, you're weak to rock, so thank you for existing. Let's do this. Let's go. Thank you for existing. You served a purpose. It was to help me evolve. Thank you for serving your purpose. Child's level 26. 
sweet. Yes, Bridget is evolving. There was no like flashy indicator of whether or not I had to press A. It was just sitting there. <clears throat> That's so cool. His eyes turn red when he gets mad. That's awesome. Or it's a girl. Her eyes turn red. Sorry. Yeah, desk like and rock. You're awesome. Now my team's slightly different. Bathed in the setting sun of evening, Liking Rock has undergone a special kind of evolution. An intense fighting spirit underlies its calmness. What are you trying to learn? Thrash. Whoa. Whoa. Is it finally time? Then again, Rash leaves me confused, and I don't know if I want to be confused. Firefang's kind of redundant. Firefang's kind of redundant. Considering I have a fire type. Yeah! Although, yeah, yeah, sure, give me Thrash. And I would also like a stronger rock move, please. Please. I have a Lycan rock now. Ooh, an item, an Ultra Ball. Sweet. No, I don't want to take photos with my newly evolved Pokemon. I just want to stuffle. I just want to stuffle. He looks so cool. Granted, Firefang would help in this trial, but I mean, they're grass types. He's a rock type. You see, that's that's kind of bad. Come on! I know I'm pushing it at this point, but I just need it. I just need it. All I need. It's all I want. I just want a stuffle. Give me stuffle. Come on. The quest for stuffle continues. Five percent chance. Five percent chance. But Chinder is 15. Um, so Land it's 20. Young Goose is 30, and Trumbeak is 30. Makes sense given how many times I've seen Trumbeak. Makes sense. I just realized the light in my room isn't on. Anything? Uh, that's a stupid trophy. Yeah. Nah, I'll leave it off. It's fine. It's not a big deal. I can. S you can see me. I just realized because like it's dark over here and my face isn't as bright as it normally would be. Come on. There's a trainer with a Luxio? Oh no, Sun and Moon Island Scan gets you a Luxio. Excuse me, who has a Salamence? Pokemon Trainer. Oh, Annabelle. Annabelle has a Salamence and um Sun and Moon. Young Goose. 
Thirty percent. Awesome. Stuffo. Stuffo. Is this going to be like the Solandit where I need to catch it off screen? <laughs> Probably. Probably. That's probably going to be the case. Come on. Come on. I'm going to give it a few more tries. Yes? Stuffle? Young Goose, of course. Young Goose. Oh, no, it's a 10% in this game. It's a 10%... Yeah. There's more of a chance to encounter it. 15% chance for Fletchinder. 15% chance for Solandit. 30% chance for Trumbeak and Young Goose. Stuffle, thank you! It showed up! Now don't have klutz. Please don't have klutz. We're gonna test that right now. Nope. Not even gonna try. It's super effective. But. It's also a pick. Bite's not very effective. Yeah. Also, is it male or female? I didn't check. Oh, Dark Pulse. Interesting. Awesome. Just awesome. It called a Stuffle. That's another level 20 Stuffle. Oh, let's hope it's this one. Oh, that was Brutal Swing. I don't know which one, just... Well, I have an idea. Yeah, it was the left one, so if I left it, it would kill me. Okay. You're dead. Now you, my friend. You need to take a Fire Fang. Thank you for lowering my attack. Good job, Stuffle friend. And then you need to get in this Ultra Ball. I could have used a Quick Ball on you. Crap. Oops. Well then. Yay, I caught it. He's my Stuffle friend. And I have four Pokemon for the next trial. Sweet. I evolved a Pokemon this episode, and I got a new party member. I'm doing good. I'm doing all right. And he's not that far behind my other party members, to think of it. It's not that bad. Stuffle, you will be named Lotso. Lotso, hugging bear. I was gonna name you Winnie, but like, you're pink. Lots of purple, and I feel like he could kill anyone with a simple hug, just like beware. Lots of the stuffle. That was all I wanted to do this episode. Wow, this game looks really sad at like 530. Because in the in-game time, it's like 537 right now. This game looks really sad. So dark. Oh, my team is looking cool. My team's looking great. But anyway, next episode, we're gonna go 
fight uh, Mallow's trial in Lush Jungle. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you all later.